for feeling behind my eyes. Hi guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how I was able to clone myself in a video just like the intro video you just saw now okay so i'll be telling you how i was able to achieve that using cap cuts hi hello if you're new here <laughs> my name is jennifer and you're welcome to the youtube channel please don't forget to subscribe comment and like let's get right into this video guys okay so before we go on we start by opening our cap cuts up and then now guys i've gone ahead to create um the video for this particular tutorial right so i'm going to be using two clips of myself added the clips that i want to use so i just go down to the second clip and click on overlay and turn this clip down overlay basically so now i'm just going to try and adjust the clips to where i want to be um basically try to edit it you know remove unnecessary things that do not feel um needs to be in the video cut out the and clips on on especially stuff that are, you know are not meant to be there so to create this video you can use more than one character so you can create like three or four or five depending on what you're trying to do right depending on what kind of character you're trying to create right just have fun with it honestly okay so now i'm done removing the excess clips i do not need so i'm just going to click on the overlay and i'm going to search for max so now i'm going to click on split because we're trying to make a double ganger of me obviously so we're going to use split now you see this yellow um line over here and with the feathers or the arrow right there so we're just going to adjust the arrow to benefit the way we want or the way we want it to be you know we're just going to play around with it and see what suits us best okay so when you're done with that you're just going to click like um the arrow to you know fade it out or fade it in you know depending on really what you want and how you want your video to look like basically if you ever wondered how um people do cloning of themselves and videos their instagram reels their tiktoks etc this is basically how they do it right you can also use this method for your tiktok format or your ig reels okay so this masking tool can also do other things just aside from cloning yourself right it can help you do transitions even blow out some um effects or pictures or things you do not want somebody somebody like me When you're done just save your video and yeah you can use it okay guys so that's how i was able to achieve this video and i hope you guys really like this uh, mini tutorial okay please leave your comment in the comment section i'll be there to reply and you know suggestions what kind of videos do you want to see um let me know i'm ready to make those such videos for you guys okay yeah see you guys in my next video bye